Yo, what up? So look, I seen people doing this fucking, excuse my language, this 2K tier list, I guess, 2K YouTubers. Now, I don't have the knowledge of all these people, you know. A lot of people that may watch this video, maybe you have the knowledge, you know. So I'm not going to put all these people on my list because I don't know these people. And a lot of motherfuckers probably don't know who I am, you know. I'm not a celebrity. I mean, I feel like it, but uh, I'm not. So boom. Let's get straight to the bullshit. We're going to scroll through every one of these lists and I'm going to make my own decisions. You understand? So let's get straight to the bullshit. Uh, it's a lot of people, so this may take a little minute. Uh, I don't think this is the person, right? Who the fuck is this? All right. I don't know who this is. I don't know who 2K Tuts is. Let's start with this guy, the Aiden kid. You know, maybe low-key a fruity loop. Maybe bisexual. Doesn't really matter. You know, he met LeBron online. He played with his son. Yip de doo that was 2K what, 20, I think? Death, um, what the fuck? Come on, bro. Well, Who is that? All right, I was watching some ESPN shit. So anyway, boom. Let's get him out of here. We're going to put him respectfully. I mean, I feel like I'm going to give him an A. Now, that may be too high for a lot of y'all, but let me explain. He met LeBron. Oh, he talked to LeBron. You know, a lot of us will never speak to LeBron, uh, play with his son. He kind of fell off after that because, obviously, maybe he didn't like the game, but I put him at an A. Uh, don't know who the fuck you are. Now this agent dude. Now, he I, I don't really watch him that much, but I know of him. Uh, he's not really a good 2K player to me, but, I mean, I have to be fair. I, I have to give him... I mean, he, run, he talks about the community. He tried to make the game better. He stepped away. Like, he stepped away. I haven't really heard from him since. Like, I don't really know, man. I, I, I'm going to give him a B, man. I'm going to give him a B respectfully. I may have to hurt a lot of y'all feelings. I don't really care. I'm not your friend. Uh, Now, this dude annoying. Now, 2K20. Now, I remember him playing 2K16 on the box. Uh, He did play. Uh, I don't really remember him besides 16 and 20 to be honest you know like i said i didn't watch a lot of these people so i'm gonna give him a respectful b you know what i'm saying like when i think of s's and a's i'm thinking people that really did shit like he was popping in 20 for them for them wages but one year to me isn't enough that's my personal opinion one year to me isn't enough now these people that i put in b's they have a lot of subscribers you know what i'm saying but at the same time that's just because you have a lot of subscribers that just means people know who you are and they fuck with you but that's them that ain't me i'm being unbiased you know so boom here we go who's this i think this is badge plug am i correct i think i know who that is i don't really watch him too much um he's a better player than <laughs> aiden fucking uh agent let's see like i want to put him at the b but i feel like they shouldn't he shouldn't be in that I don't think he's in the class of annoying and Asian. I feel like that's disrespecting them. So let me see if I can make another list. Like I, I, I can't put a man named Badge Plug in the same category as annoying and, and, and Asian. That's too disrespectful. So I'm gonna put him in the B plus category. I'm gonna put him as a B. Alright, now this bandit dude. Um somebody who I feel like an overrated motherfucker. I mean, he has. I feel like he he got his views and his name because he knows people. Uh, I feel like wasn't he a part of that Nadex clan shit? If your leaders are racist, you don't get my respect. I mean, I don't really think he's that good of a player. I mean, I say what the fuck I want. What the fuck he gonna do? He getting a C. I don't give a fuck. I mean, that's being generous. I don't give a fuck. He, he should have been bigger. Don't he? Like he don't even have two hundred K on YouTube. How? When you got all these connections? Uh, let's see. I think this is that BDG kid. Um, he really got big this year. Um, it really depends on where he goes. I can't really, I, I it's, it's too early to tell with somebody like him, but I'm gonna give him a solid C. Now, Brute. Let's see. I mean, he cool, he cool. I mean, he's been around for a minute. I just feel like he hasn't really popped, you know what I'm saying? But I can't put him at D, that's disrespectful. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I, I can't put him at a D. Like, I, that's too disrespectful, so I got to put him at a C-, minus. you know what I'm saying? I can't put him at a D. That's a little too too grimy. Don't know who this is. Don't know who this is. This guy, the Cash Nasty dude, Um, he's not a good 2K player as far as, like, stick movement, pause. 
I mean, he ain't fucking with me in no park. He's not a park player. I think he's just doing my team. He played a little bit of park back in them old 2Ks, but wasn't he like a my team dude? That's to me. I got to put him in the Bs. Like, people talking about what he did for the community. What he, I don't know, bro. I don't know my research. So, boom. I don't know who this guy is. He got a picture of John ja Morant. The cheeseaholic dude. Um, Somebody who is um underrated to me. You know what I'm saying? He make that 2K shit. He been consistent for too long. He got a mill. He got a mill. I got to put him at the B. Plus, the Chico Filo dude, he, he kind of got popping because of Tassino. He started out, I respect him because he started out ass as fuck. Then he got better at the game. I bangs with his with his, with his his uh determination to get better. You know what I'm saying? I mean, it's 2K. I don't know how the fuck you got into the game ass as fuck, but you got right. So I'm going to give you a solid B, man. I'm going to give you a B. Uh, this guy, is, I think he's the pro-am player. I heard about him. Oh, he did some some foul shit. I mean, I'm going to put you in the I don't give a fuck. Like, I, I don't care about you. Now, I didn't put these other people in the I don't give a fuck because I don't know them. Like, if I know them and I don't care about you, if I know you even a little bit and I don't care about you, then I'm going to put you in the I don't give a fuck. But I don't know these people. Now, call the man, man. This guy's a bastard. Um, I don't like call the man because... I remember when I was streaming back in them old days, like 2K18, he came in my stream. He was typing up a storm too, like he was a fan of some. Uh, he did that for a few like smaller channels, but he never really collabed. He just did it, I guess he was laughing a lot, like shit was, was funny, like a fan would. I played Flight, he was on my dick spamming in the, in the comment section. This is back in 2K19, I got a video playing Flight, but he was streaming his day, obviously. It's called a man dude was on my dick saying 40 year old virgin, like... I will fuck this man up. Like, I don't like this bitch. But even though I don't like this bitch, he's been fiending for a couple of years. So, um, he's still, I think he's still, I don't know. Like, I think he still get consistent views. Um, he's a bot. He don't play no comp. He a bitch. He, like, the few times I've seen him play on, on, on his Twitch channel, um, anytime he plays somebody good, he would cry like a hoe. So, I mean, putting him at the B plus seems too disrespectful. So, I'm going to probably put him at the B. I put him in the same category as a Chico in, in, a, in a badge plug. I don't really bang with him, bro. I'm, I mean, I got to put Davis in the B+. Plus, you know what I'm saying? I, I got to put him just a little bit over the Bs. Just barely. He barely made the B+. Pluses. Um, I, I, I think I know who this is. Ain't he, like, related to Duke Dennis? Some Dave Migo? I don't know. I really don't give a fuck. So, the DBG, no. Uh, Not really. Now, this kid. D now motherfucker. Now, I watched a few of his streams. He seemed cool. Um, I don't got no problem with him. Hallelujah, holla back. My problem is, I mean, he's not an A. He's not a B. What I really remember him for was being nice. I think he was top five in 2K20, right? Cool. Um, after that, 21, he wasn't playing guard. From what I remember, 2K22. I mean, I seen he's been he been playing some wages recently on the tools, but like for the whole year he really wasn't playing guard, so like he kind of fall down. Like if he would have continued from that two K twenty, I would have gave him like a B plus, so like off the off, off the strength of being consistent. But I feel like I gotta give him, I gotta give him a. I feel like he above these motherfuckers. Hold on, he he above he. Hold on, hold on. I'm gonna give him. A, I'm gonna give him a B minus. Like I can't put him in the in the B category, but he, he like I think a B minus is fine. They put this nigga here, this real dog bastard. That's crazy. I mean, yeah, he got subs and shit. Uh, like how? Uh, I mean, I can't really say much about. It. I don't care. I think one time when I had a Twitter, he he tweeted about me. You know, he typed in one of my streams. I violated him. Like I violated a lot of you people. And he tweeted about it saying I came at him disrespectful. You know how bitches be mad and shit because people think they important. Um, I mean, I gotta give him a C minus. He don't ring no bells. He not he nothing to me. I'm sorry. Don't know. Don't know the double H H kid. Um. He cool. He actually consistent. You know what I'm saying? I'm saying he cool like I know him. I don't really know him or bang with him. But, I mean, he got some good videos. So, I'll give him a B. We got Duke Dennis. Now, this is somebody who I think is overrated in the community. He get too much love. Now, what I mean by that is, like, he don't deserve to get hated. I'm not saying he don't hate the motherfucker. But, a lot of you people swallow me and let this nigga pass. Like, we not damn near the same age. But, uh, you know, that's just dick riding 101. But, anyway... 
and 17 came out everybody was saying he was one of the best stretches i really didn't hear about him you know so luminati was taking over uh he was still in his prime but i'm gonna give this guy i mean i'm not gonna disrespect this motherfucker and put him with the, with the d nails or 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 the cold man's bot ass uh but i will put him at a b plus and that's me being unbiased you know what i'm saying like i don't really bang with him or hate him i just like he's really nothing to me but at the same time i gotta be respectful you know i gotta i gotta be cool this flexing dude i've seen a couple of his videos he made good videos but i mean he got a he got a good fan base he made good videos he's staying in his lane i hope he don't think like he's a he's a he's a nice 2k player but i'm a i mean respectfully i could put him at a b minus he's a he's a he's a head of the bandit kid he's a head of the bandit kid we got flight i mean this is this is a problem this, this is somebody who is it's tough for me because I could put him at an S, but I didn't watch his 2K videos like that, like, you know, or his streams. I feel like he's too versatile, you know what I'm saying? He's too versatile, but he's consistent. Like, he's been consistently great, but just not at that S tier to me. There's nothing wrong with it, but he did get 70,000 views at on Twitch playing 2K. He did. So right there now fredo come on bro now i don't give a fuck what nobody say this guy has to be s tier man i'm sorry bro this g slice kid a no life in his prime uh good at the game i guess for what it's worth i'm gonna give this guy i don't want to disrespect him and put him right here because i feel like that's disrespectful to the to these two because they've been consistently in they shit like if you taking breaks my nigga like I feel like you gotta go down, but I feel like he's not on the same category as these two. So I gotta give, I gotta put him at a C plus. Now the GV kid, somebody who is an interesting character. Um, he's a good player. He played a lot of ones this year. Um, I think he was a part of that Nadex crew too, right? Um, but at the same time, he's a, he's cool. He, I probably put him at the C plus because he's been consistent. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna put him at the C plus. It was hard. It, that's hard though. Um, the grinding kid, I know of him, but I'm gonna put him in the I don't give a fuck because I don't really watch his videos. Hank the Tank, hmm. he's an oddball, but um, even with his odd shenanigans, I'm gonna give him a B minus, which is kind of bad. Excuse me. He should actually be higher. But I feel like he's just been too inconsistent. Now, let's continue. This is a problem. Why is this kid here? This is a problem. Um, I'm going to put him in the I don't give a fuck because this guy, right? Ain't his name Heezy or some shit like that? What's his name? Heezy? Why is he here? He doesn't even have as many subs as me. Now, I know he probably, he probably going to pass me in subs. I don't care. Like, congrats. He got 400 plus videos. That's cool. His views looking cool. 7,000. Great. Congratulations, bro. Hopefully, he continues it. And all that extra shit, right? My problem is, who made this? Like, why, why, why? Like, my name isn't in this. My picture's not here. But when it comes to swallowing, I bet everybody would know who the fuck I am. You know, I'm not saying he ass or nothing. I'm just flabbergasted. You know what I'm saying? When I was getting thousands of views in 19, and Troy then was running them tournaments, no, no bitch ever said, yo, put, put Sly, put Sleece, whatever the, you bitches call me. Nobody ever said, put me in one of them 2v2 shits. I, I don't understand, man. Uh, IQ contained. I don't give a fuck. Not saying that, I'm not saying none of these people are ass. I just don't care. Like I know who they are. I just don't watch them. You know what I'm saying? I just heard them. Joe knows. Now I'm not a fan of Joe knows. Um, he remind, he's kind of like in the same boat as a colder man to me. Um, I mean he's boring as fuck. He makes me go to sleep. But he got a following. He's been consistent. Um, if I'm being unbiased. Um, I gotta put him. I don't feel like he's in the same category as these people, so I'm gonna put I'm gonna put him here, and then I'm gonna make a A minus. La Monster, somebody who's been consistent. I respect his consistency, so I'm gonna give him a B. You know what I'm saying? Like I feel like he just hasn't made that leap. You know what I'm saying? Like I don't. It's hard for me to explain that leap because I haven't reached my leap. Probably won't ever reach mine. But you know he got like over 600k subscribers so i'm gonna put him right here at the b very underrated though this guy somebody that i i recognize somebody that had a splash kind of fell off then he got back on i'm gonna give this guy hold on let me get him out the way i'm gonna get this neon kid i don't give a fuck get him out the way with that weird picture i'm gonna give this kid a solid 
I feel like putting him at the B is kind of disrespectful. I'm gonna put him here because like when the game was popping, popping, he was popping, popping. When the game was popping, popping. So, now Pugatti, I mean like. I really don't give a fuck, but I feel like, you know, he had a little run. You know what I'm saying? He started doing wages and shit, getting back up. He not really comp. I feel like one. he only had one good year. 2K19, he was low-key kind of nice. But after that, he kind of ass. So, like, I'm cool with giving him a B-. minus. You know what I'm saying? Because he be streaming hard body. I'm cool with giving this man a B-. minus. I'm going to put Chris Move at a... He, he got to be recognized as one of the best. You know what I'm saying? He wasn't really a park player, but he make my career popping. So I gotta, I gotta put him here. You know, the so Illuminati bastard. Um, <laughs> nah, I'm joking. Uh, but uh, yeah, I gotta put him in the S because he changed the game. Well, he made it, he made it even more popping. Everybody was still in his lingo, making bills that he made. Gotta give him, gotta give him props. Uh, the I show speed kid. Uh, I'm gonna put him in. The, I don't give a fuck, cause I really truly don't. Um. Uh oh, is this the Stax Montana dude? I for, yo, I, I ain't gonna lie. I'm gonna have to give this dude a C because he was popping at 15, bro. Now I'm gonna give him a C minus because I feel like he fell the fuck off bad after 15. Like, I don't know if he was still relevant for a couple years, but that's the last time I heard of him. The Swante kid, somebody who fiend who, who claimed he was one of the best in 15 and 16, fell off bad. The Swante kid. Somebody who claimed that he was one of the best at 15 and 16. He used to fiend for the game. Just to fall off hard body. I feel like that's very bad. Um, I'm not going to disrespect him though. And put him in, in the C category. Um, I'm going to put him in the C plus. Because he did have a run. But after like what 16. I really don't remember him. 17, 18, 19, 20. He playing 2K. But his name not ringing bells like it did back in 15 and 16. So I'm going to give him a C plus, And that's really bad. We're going to give the Steezo kid change dribbling. People were on his jock. I ain't going to lie. People was on this man jock, yo. But I feel like he was overrated. When he lost to Ticino in the park, it showed, like, stop swallowing him. Like, he could dribble. He's unique as, as far as dribbling the ball. Yes, he changed. The, he, he did shit. But let's stop swallowing. So that stops me from putting him in the S tier. And he's not really that consistent. But his following is strong. There's a lot of nerds out there. A lot of anime cartoon characters that love him. So I'm going to put him at an A. Uh, this Tonio kid. Somebody who I feel like he just plays. You know what I'm saying? He just plays. Uh, he got a good following. So I'm going to give him a solid C. The Angel kid. Wow. I forgot about him. Just because I forgot about him, I'm, I'm, I'm going to give him a C, man. Minus. I'm going to give him a C-. I'm going to put him in the category of these people. Because I have not heard from him in, in, in a while. But Tassino. Wow. Um, this is somebody who has to be. I don't give a fuck. His year, 18? Magnificent. I can't remember him in 19. But I know I think he was still relevant in 19. 19? Solid. But it was 18. And it was... um. It was 18. And it was 20 for me. You know? He kept the game alive. He kept the game alive when all the quote-unquote OGs were gone. I'm going to put this G-Man kid, somebody who is not really a comp player. You know what I'm saying? I beat him numerous times. I could have dropped numerous videos. I wish I I wish I would have. You know what I'm saying? But, I was, but I'm such a cool person. And at the time, I didn't have a problem with him. But, you know, he a fake bastard. He unsubscribed from my channel. So, like, now I just wish I would have uploaded those videos. But... It is what it is, but it's but he did make a little noise. Definitely somebody who's overrated, but um, apparently he makes this amazing quality videos. I don't really know how people be thinking that shit is amazing to me, but um, he got 600k. I'm sorry, he's a B. He's a B. Like besides fucking Tassino up, what the fuck does this kid do, bro? Like I'm not gonna. What's so groundbreaking about this guy? I don't give a fuck. He's a B. I'm, I'm not gonna lie to you. Sorry. Don't get mad at me. He ain't a fucking goat. He ain't in the S. He, he, he ain't here. He ain't here. I mean, he didn't start the, the dribble movement. He followed the dribble movement. He ain't here. What, what what the fuck does he do? He's one of the few people that got popped, that blew up. He could be at a mill right now. He don't be doing shit. But anyway, that's just my personal opinion. Don't get mad at me, bitch. I ain't your friend. This kid right here, I think he's a fan of Bandit. When I was on Twitter that one time and I was talking, about, talking shit about all the other YouTubers, this was like years ago. He didn't mind his business. He was sucking dick. This tiger, this kid looked like Tiger on crack. 
I think his name's Statistics or some shit. I don't fuck with this kid. I punch this nigga in his face. But, um, you know, he's definitely a no life, but I can't really rate him because I don't really care about him or I, I don't know what he really do. I just know he a no life. Uh, I think he's part of like the X, he was a part of the Xbox clan, some shit. Like, I don't, I really don't know, but I just know he was on my dick. Uh, that was years ago, though. He need to stop swallowing kids. Hopefully, he doing something with himself. Um, Mo Buckets, man. Sorry. This guy, he's a legend, man. Top top three 2K streamer in his prime. Like, if I had to choose a streamer in a year, like, him in 2K19 was magnificent. So, that alone, he's a B+. Plus. I'm sorry. Say what you want about him. He's a B+, plus, solid B+. Plus. Uh, I'm going to put him ahead of him. Like, I don't want to even see Joe Nose, like, in the front. Like, to put that bitch in the back. So, boom. Sorry, you're going to have to respect Mo Buckets. Troyden is cool. I'm going to give him... I'm going to give this Troyden man a B. Matter of fact, no, I'm going to put him in the A because it, he was running tournaments, giving away money. I fucks with it. I, I'll give him that, bro. I'm a, I'm a, I am fucks with it. Uh... All right, the phone stopped ringing. Cool. So I'm gonna give this Iggy Mo kid a solid C. Um, I'm not really a fan of him, but uh, you know, he was playing with Tassino, got his name up there. Why? This nigga called again. Like, I'm gonna give this motherfucker right here. The Kel hit him up. Definitely an OG. He fell off bad, but I mean, his his run was impeccable back in them days. So it's hard. Like, can't give him the goat status. But I don't want to disrespect him. I don't want to put him here. Because when I first started playing, he was one of the people that was popping. He had 15, 16. That was like a two-year run and he fell low. So I got to put him a little low. Like It, it pains me to do this because this is one of the OGs. But I'm, I got to put him at a B. I can't put him too high and I can't put him too low. Sorry, Kel. Oh, the lie kid. Somebody who's who I feel is also overrated. He's a no-life. He be slaving 2K. This is somebody that, that, that loves 2K that you know this nigga depends on 2K. I'll put him right here because he, he be getting the most views on Twitch. So I'll, I'll put him at a B plus. Uh, who else we got? We got the Chris ZTV dude. I'll put him at a C plus. I feel like he don't really make that much noise. I mean, he he's a good guard, but I feel like he could have been more. Fucking with Tassino carrying him, I feel like his name don't really hold that much weight for some odd reason. It is what it is. Don't hate me, baby. Hate yourself. Oh, uh, the Zernick. AKA somebody that Tassino used to run with. He's not really a grinder like that, so I'm gonna give him a C minus respectfully. Um nah, I'm gonna give him a D for being lazy, because at least these other four people actually like put in work. I mean, this is what I got. I feel like I, for me, my picture not being shown, whoever made this is obviously like I'm not gonna say they a dick eater, but like, this is incredible how this kid is here. I, I don't understand. So, like, he must be friends with whoever made this list. Soluminati, Tassino, him. I, and where the fuck is poor boy Sin at? I don't know why poor boy Sin isn't on this shit. I'm not really a fan of... He be talking crazy. I think that motherfucker don't like me because I was, I was playing him or something. I don't really give a fuck. Like, I'm not that man friend. I'm just trying to give the motherfucker some type of respect. But um, if I had the poor boy Sin, I'd probably put him in the... I'll probably fuck around, put them in the A minus category too. Got the B pluses, you got the Bs. Um, you got the B minuses, you got the Cs, you got the C the C plus, the Cs, the C minuses, the Ds. And then the I don't give a fuck. All these people probably talk to at least one other person, you know what I'm saying? I don't talk to none of these bitches, so I, I guess I understand. I, I was never good at making friends. But that's it. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Hallelujah, hallelujah. <laughs>